All right, let's make a 10 second tape loop. All right, get your cassette tape, open it up. Make sure you have one with screws because we have to be able to get in and out easily. Go ahead and unscrew it and open it very carefully not to spill any of the contents. Take the tape out. You can cut the leader off. If you need to use that tape, then just set it aside. Now, these poles are what you need. You're going to have to have a cassette tape that has at least the top pole um, because we're going to loop around that. Not all cassettes have it. All right. I'm going to measure out the tape. This one's going to be around 20 inches for a 10 second loop. Cutting the tape at a 45 degree angle to try to help make it a little smoother, although I'm still not very good at that part. You can see the method of taping the tape down and now connecting it with the other side. Got a clean connection there. Pretty strong. And now we're ready to trim the excess clear tape off. Get it off both sides as closely as you can. Um, I think a razor or exacto knife would be a lot better for this little task than the scissors. You could set it on the table, but I don't have that, so just making do with what I got. I'm going to try to get it as clean as you can. Don't worry about cutting the little bit of tape here and there. It's not going to make a big difference. And there's what I have. And here we go with this big... 10 second loop. It's a little bit harder than the 5 second loop because there's a lot more tape to deal with. Um, but not very hard at all though. Just a touch more difficult. So get the front end loaded. That's where I like to start. Both sides. Throw in the reels. And now we begin what makes it a 10 second loop. You take it all the way over the top pole and then bring it down after the second reel but loop it from the bottom. And now bring that over to the first reel very carefully and there it is and basically I made my loop too long and big so I'm putting in these larger reels but that didn't work out either so after several edits to the tape I finally got it down to this and this is what I wanted it to look like uh, the small reels and now I have a finished tape loop 
Mine did not come out to 10 seconds. It's actually about eight and a half seconds because I did cut it down a few times. Uh, and you can see the pathway here. So you can make your own. Now time to close it up and hear what it sounds like. Oh, <laughs> my 